Hello, welcome to my equestrian winter routine. So we start off by leaving the house in the snow and then we get into the car, start heading to the yard. As we're on the way at the yard, we're driving up the country lanes in the snow, just praying that we don't slip off the roads. The views at the yard on this time of the morning is unreal. So I get out of the car and I start walking to the yard. I go in and see Geordie first, make sure he's okay. And I obviously say hello to Questy. I walk round to the feed room to go grab their breakfasts. Nearly bumping into people, not watching where I'm going. So you can see here, I grab their feeds. Once I've had the feeds, I get them ready for turnout. Geordie and Quest are going out in their winter paddock first. So them two enjoying the lovely field. And then I'm off to go get Audrey now. Same with her, she's going in with Quest and Geordie. Now I start mucking out Quest. I've already done Geordie at this point, so I just thought I'd do a quick time lapse. So I'll let you watch this with some aesthetic music. So here's Quest's bed done. Just a quick muck out for her. And there's Geordie's. Also, I just left his bed up. Just let the mats dry. Didn't muck it out properly, so I skipped that out later. So I went down to see Geordie and Quest. They were grooming each other. I got Geordie in. Put him in the solarium, like you can see. We then gave his tail a wash and we plaited that up just to make it nice so we give that a good shampoo and condition as you can tell he wasn't very impressed and then we turned him back out luckily i have a good pony he turned himself back out because he's a dream then me and kate decided to go to mcdonald's because that's what our life usually consists of over the weekend. Again, driving on the very scary lanes in the very scary snow. This was the absolute state of the car park next to McDonald's. Then look at the views when we came back to see the ponies. We weren't gone very long. So I brought Jordy in and decided to put him on the lunge. But we did some long raining first. He was a very good boy at this point, as you can tell. So then we put him on the lunge, just with the double lunge line. Um, we kept his rug on just because we didn't want him to get cold. Um, so it, he went really well on the lunge and on the long rain. We were doing plenty of changes of rain, serpentines. So it was really good for him. Then we brought them back in because it got really dark all of a sudden. So don't mind if it's dark. So went to the top of the barn to show you how dark it was because it was well and truly pitch black, as you can see. So now we move on to nets. We did all three of the nets. Two of them were quests and one of them were Geordie's. This pink one here is quests. Just weighed that quickly again. This one's quests again. And this one's Geordie's.
So once I'd done them nets, took them round the back and put them around the back to wait for them to be ready to hang, hang up. Then once I waited, I put quests up for her, which obviously she was over the moon about. Quest isn't my pony, but I do look after her on the weekends. Same with Audrey. Jordy is my pony, but I do look after these two over the weekends. So now we're moving on to skipping out. So I went to the tack room to get the skipping out stuff, which is hidden at the top so nobody steals my stuff. Then once I was done, I put the fork back in its place because I'm so clean. Not really. And then, yep, the dark. <laughs> so I went to check on Audrey because I hadn't seen her since bringing her in. She was fine, just chilling. So then it was time to go home. So switched off the lights locked up well i went to say buy the pony first obviously and give him a treat good night geordie then i locked the barn up it was making a very aggressive squeaky noise and as the shutters closing quickly shut the gates because i was last and then hopped in the car, ready to go home. The door didn't open. So hopped in, ready to go home. We're on our way back now on the country lanes. So we are nearly home at this point. So I just wanted to say thank you very much for watching. And please subscribe for more content like this.